Great, the goddamn elevators are out. What am I supposed to do, jump down? They've no power. If you reconnect the power, they'll start working again. So it looks like I need to find a circuit breaker. But where the hell is it? I could follow the wires, but they're all hidden inside the walls. Electrical emissions can be detected via scanner. What's with the Vovas with black bodies, Nikolai? Regular VOV A6s follow my orders and are always polite. But the black ones walk around like they own the place. They go wherever they want, just ignore orders. But take care. There's a dandelion security camera up ahead. If it detects us, this place will be swarming with robots. Take it easy. I can always distract it by throwing something, then knock it out with an EMP. Yesterday, one of them bumped into me and didn't even apologize. They only respond to people with high social ratings or something. Get back to me when you can. I'm a little freaked out of this. Attention, all staff members who receive their notice are to report to social control by end of the day. They will report with a certain aggravating circumstance.
Hey, Chuck. Charles. Whatever. What'll happen if word gets out about this? The Soviet Union's reputation will suffer. Soviet robots are considered to be perfectly safe and reliable all over the world. They are? Of course they are. That's why Petrov's treason struck at the very heart of the motherland. He quite literally stabbed his own country in the back. He wants the entire world to stop using our robots. That son of a bitch. They say Monday begins on Saturday, but I'd like you to really take the weekend off. As you know, national polymerization is happening through... the Soviet Union on Monday the 13th that our executive leaders want us to put together a team of volunteers for the upcoming celebrations. Anybody who works on the 11th or the 12th will get a reprimand, not a bonus. Have a great weekend. the key. We can access the circuit breaker now. Yep. But I'm just gonna have a look around first. I need some parts to upgrade my weapon. I won't get far with this pile of shit. I wouldn't dream of stopping you. Smart move, Charles. Smart move. Hey, let's put a cookie in there. Yeah, even locks like cookies, right? Charles? Yes? Do you like cookies? Ahem. This is a passive security system with a laser relay. I've seen stuff like this plenty of times. You need a color code. Unfortunately, we don't have any codes. You'll have to try to decipher it using logic. Seriously? Like I was gonna stand here until it turns off on its own.
Try to match the colors of the laser beams with the colors of the lights. That should help. Yeah, the power's on. Let's head back. Well, which one? I suggest the one on the right. In other words, you don't actually know. In that case, I'm taking the one on the left. I've marked another waypoint for ease of navigation. How dense do you think I am? I know where I need to go to complete my mission. I was only trying to make things easier for you. You can make things easier by getting off my grill. I, to my shame. If you recall, the door is electromagnetically locked. Are you freaking deaf or something? Pardon me, please continue. Attention. Remember that illicit possession and dissemination of experimental data constitutes a crime against the Communist Party and is punishable by capital punishment.
receiving data. Alexander Yefremov, please report to dispatch. Saving data. Please select the desired procedure.
Orlov Complex is one of the facility's largest subdivisions. It comprises of dozens of workshops, laboratories, warehouses and archives, a cafeteria, a visitor center, and a recreation area. This is a real underground city, complete with its own transportation network, running high-speed cable cars and elevators. Where resistance and Saving data. With family members and friends who are not complex employees. There's no other way forward. We have to take it. Take it where? Petrov escaped while working in Vavilov's cold workshop. It would be logical to begin our search there. So, how do I get there? First, we need to get to the distribution center. This cable car will take us there. You can swim through polymer. I've done it before. It's nice, actually. Kind of like swimming with whales and dolphins in the ocean. It's so peaceful. Reboot the control system to reactivate the line. How am I supposed to restart the line? There should be a control panel nearby. <laughs> you don't say. There's the control panel. And of course it's locked. You guys just love these things, don't you? But this is a new one. A combination lock. Ah, it'd take me a year to guess the combo. Look around. Maybe someone has the code. The schematic. Need to find the schematic. Uh, what was that? A glorious new era of Soviet. They won't go without a schematic. All stuck. No schematic. No go. Fuck me. He's alive. Schematic. Need a schematic. Unfortunately, he's dead. We are surrounded by corpses. Why have you frozen just like everything here? They won't go. Nope, won't go without the schematic. The dead have a residual neuropolymer memory and are capable of communicating for some time after death. Well, shit. Okay, so where's this diagram of yours? Schematic? The schematic, the one I need to move the cars. Where is it? The station master has it. He didn't make it. Such a wasn't as fast as me. He died. Everybody here is as dead as fuck. Did the station master die in this tunnel? This tunnel? He died. And everything froze. Right in front of my eyes. You need the schematic. Are you sure the station master has it? Does he take it with him everywhere he goes? He carries it with him. The station master. Find him. Find him. Get the schematic. Got it. I'll look for it. Maybe I should have said thank you. Holy shit, a talking corpse. They won't go without a schematic. All stuck. No schematic. No go. Fuck me, he's alive. Schematic. Need a schematic. Unfortunately, he's dead. 
We are surrounded by corpses. Why have you frozen just like everything here? They won't go. Nope, won't go without the schematic. The dead have a residual neuropolymer memory and are capable of communicating for some time after death. Will be able to couple with one another to produce a the schematic, the one I need to move the cars, where is it? The station master has it. And he didn't make it. Zones. Wasn't as fast as me. He died. Everybody here is as dead as fuck. Did the station master die in this tunnel? This tunnel, he died, and everything froze right in front of my eyes. You need the schematic. And the first such city in the clouds will Gotta find the station master. I just wish I knew where he is. Of our Soviet Union. Which will Could soar be. above us all in just problem, ten years' time. Comrades. We're now witnessing a glorious new era of Soviet urban development. There it is. Charles. So this isn't a dead person talking to me. It's the neuropolymer in his noggin, right? Crudely speaking, yes. As it fades away, neuropolymer memory temporarily stores the individual's last thoughts. Creepy. How long are they gonna talk for? I can't say exactly. Somewhere between a minute and a couple of days. But it seems the more time passes after death, the more corrupt the information becomes. I see. So the stuff they're saying isn't always that important. Poor bastards. I hope this works. The cable car line is activated. Welcome, passengers. Please take your seats according to your ticket. Sorry, no ticket. Movement! Moving! Set them out! Speed them up! 
We are ready to depart. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Off we go. Ugh, this tunnel's messed up. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. Fuck. I knew it was gonna be rough. 